also have a job. I do that overnight. So I would like to tell you how I started. All right, wait, 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 wait. Before we get into how you got started and everything, what's, what's, what's your name? What, what's your name? Well, I never get my name. When I talk to um, the people who call me, I never ask them their name. They don't give it to me, and I don't give them my name. Uh, you don't give, okay, okay. So you don't give them your name, and you don't give, and they don't give them their name. Right. I don't really know if they would like this on them, but I don't ask. Uh, okay. So for all intents and purposes of talking to me, I would like to know your name. <laughs> I won't say okay, you, you but... can give me a you can give me a tag name or anything like that. It doesn't it, okay, you call me Red. Red. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. But for all intents and purposes going forward from here, it'll just be BWC. All right, that's uh, okay. that's what you that's what you are uh, offering in the thing. All right, so so tell me a little bit about this. I mean, I you you posted in a in a Facebook group, and um, and I think this would have been a good idea, like back in the day, but for like now with technology the way it is. I don't know. So, so talk to me. How how did you how 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 did you come across of of doing something like this? Okay, I, and I want I would like to make this kind of fast because I work now. If you would have called me midnight to six in the morning, we could have did this all night. But I got to keep it limited because I got to go back to work. Okay, no problem. So, I, okay, forever. I always stayed up all night. Mm -hmm. So one night. This man just calls my inbox. He's a truck driver. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm not, I'm, he was on a truck with another man who was training him. Okay. They got into it. The man put him off his truck. Right. He called me. I'm like, I mean, how am I going to help you? He was just like, you're the only, it's like three o'clock in the morning. He said, you're the only person I know that's woke. Mm -hmm. He was like, please, just talk to me. He was like, they're supposed to send somebody to come get me. So I said, okay, no problem. I'm up anyway. He said, I noticed you're the only person that's always woke all times of morning. So now this, I, it was okay. Now this is the Go guy ahead. that got thrown that this is the guy that got thrown off the truck. This is the guy that got, got thrown off the truck. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So he's in the middle of nowhere. It's three in the morning, you know, so I'm talking to him. Next thing you know, the, it's like over an hour, probably like two hours now. The man, the person come to get him. He's like, thank you. I needed that. No problem. Mm -hmm. I'm well, you needed someone to talk to. That's fine. Okay. Maybe a week later, he calls me back and he said, I still want to just let you know how you helped me. And I really no problem actually to this happened like two years ago i still talk to the young man so but just that with that incident that's happening we became friends now he told someone else about me he said when i was going through something i talked to this lady she never she didn't know me i can't even tell you how we became friends on facebook but he said she helped me so the friend called about his wife and what he felt his wife was doing. And I really just listened. Okay. The nation already talking to you helped me get there really fast. He was like, I ain't even thinking about the time and all that. You, I'm like, man, I'm not there yet. So just, I started thinking or whatever. I'm just like, man, some people do need. And so there so are you, people who are hurting and going through things and they cannot discuss, you know, everybody like, but, you know, you got friends, social media. Yeah. But, okay. I, I feel you on that. No, I, there's I, no, I, I feel you. I, I, I feel you on that. But the thing, you know, people, you know, people call people to, you know, maybe strangers or something like that, that it get a different, different vibe from them than talking to their family or friends or anything like that. You know, they just need somebody just to listen or to or to have a level head or open head on on uh on the conversation. That's cool. 
But my thing is this. You're charging. Wouldn't you want okay, to do now this? Now, let me tell you what it's Now, wouldn't you want to Come do in. this for like, you know, for like free or something like that? Or or uh, or maybe just say something to the effect that, um, okay, you, you know, just leave me like a tip jar, you know, leave me a donation or something like that. Because again, now like, honestly, that oh, that go, sounds that sounds good. Mm-hmm. Now let me tell you what a charger came in. Okay, okay. I carry some of that weight. I'm a very nice person, and when someone tell me about something that's bad going on in their life, I mean, I have a life too. But sometimes I carry that weight with me too. Like I be thinking about it. Like, man, I can't believe that's happening to a person. And man, you know, so that's why that's what a charging came in. Like, okay. Mm-hmm. Now, a lot of people don't like it, but mm-hmm. in this time, you mm-hmm. could choose a call or you don't. I look at it like this. Now, I know you, you're a man, so you're probably going to be like, mm-hmm. men. Okay. If this, wait a minute. First, before I say this, is this going to be played on the air before I'm <laughs> I don't want to say something that's going to be played on no air on your uh, podcast. But before I say what I'm going to say, are you going to play this man's podcast? I, I'll say work, choose your words wisely. How's that? How's that? Well, okay. Well, I'll say this then, and then mm-hmm. I'm going to leave it at this. Mm-hmm. For $20 an hour, for someone to get something off their chest, or someone to just, yeah, have a good laugh, or, you know, different things like that. It, I feel that that's not a lot. Now, I don't, no, that's you not. can do it, or you don't, or you can't, but I also feel something that comes so easy to men that they pay all this money for just to view something looking at their phone mm. that most of them go to home to every night. But guess you. what? They pay all this money. So why is it that everyone is acting like, not everyone, because I get people who will be like, this is great what you're doing or whatever. Mm-hmm. Sometimes people be like, you don't charge enough. But everybody is entitled to their own opinion. And everybody take their funds and do what they want to do with them. So, Hey, look, I'm not knocking your hustle. Don't get me wrong. I, hey, 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 let me let me just throw this out there. I'm I'm not knocking your hustle. I'm just simply saying that this would have been a good idea back then before the technology the way it is now. I mean, you got you 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 got motherfucking apps. You got motherfucking uh TV apps. You got uh, Roku, Google. You got, you know, you got so much stuff that that that'll keep you, you know, that'll keep you busy and to keep you attentive throughout the night. Then calling up a calling up a stranger, paying twenty dollars just for a conversation that somebody could just get on the on the Zelle and do for free. You see what I'm saying? But now, but back you then, you can go on. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Now, you, you can pull on BET Plus on your um phone, the app, mm-hmm. HBO. Everybody got an app. But can you really tell them your problem? Can you tell them that you're down and you're thinking about doing something that maybe you shouldn't do? Mm-hmm. Can you? You can't. You can't do any of that. So that that's your mindset and someone else's mindset. Like I, I read a comment where. Somebody said they'd rather talk to the bugs on a window. <laughs> yeah, I've seen that. <laughs> I, I, I laugh. That, that's cute. That's funny. But everybody is not the same. Oh, everybody that's true. is not the same. That's true. So, where that person want to talk to the bugs on a windshield, but someone needs someone to talk to. For real, for real. I, I'm, I'm with you on that yeah. part. I'm with you on that. So I'm not, I mean, I laugh and I, you know, when I see some of the comments and it's okay, but I do know some of the people that I've helped. I do know when people call me back or text me and be like, thank you. I really needed that. I appreciate it. That's what I, that's what I take with me. People say negative things all the time. I brush that off or whatever. For okay. Sure. For sure. 
So I just started, and you know. So the conversation doesn't necessarily has to be straightforward. You know, we we can we can conversate. It could go into, it can go left. It could go right. That's that's what you try. That's what you was trying to say in the beginning. It, it, so this in the the conversation is about what the person call, whoever calls me. Mm-hmm. The con it's all about them. So whatever it is they want to talk about. Let me say, well, you already know what most men want to talk to, exactly, talk about. Exactly, exactly. So, okay. But most people, like I said, most people are dealing with something and they just feel comfortable with talking to a stranger. It, if you notice, most people, when you're talking to your friend about something that's going on, your friend would take your side, even though they know you did wrong. But, like, you could have went about that a different way, you know. That's how, but if you're talking to a total stranger, it's a different, you know, you could ask them, you know, you could actually listen to the situation and go, well, the other person also had a point when they stated this or whatever, and now they're thinking about it and, and like, yeah, you're right. Now, I'm not, I'm not saying that I'm right about things and all that. It's just a conversation, a different outlook. Um, exactly. exactly. Like I said, the thing is, DWC, because like I said, it started, the idea kind of started with me talking to the truck driver. So it was driving while conversating or whatever. So, so, you, so it you're, got into, you're, you're not a truck driver. You're, you're, you're no, not I'm a not. truck driver. You, you was just, you, you was just in the Facebook group where the guy was, was strong enough to truck. He just so happened to come. No, by. I didn't even, I just joined the truck driving group. Well, no, no, so no, no. I'm, I, I'm talking about the truck driver uh, that got thrown off the truck. Right, but we wasn't we wasn't in a truck driving group. I was just his friend on Facebook or my personal Facebook page. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, 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 okay. That's right. So this happened like two years ago. Okay. I just joined the truck driving group when I decided that I would do it. Gotcha. Now let me ask you. Go ahead and now now let me ask you this, DWC. Let me ask you this. Um so for for hour a night, you know, you know, you 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 asking for twenty dollars. So is it just limited to conversations, or would you open it up to like video chat, or no? I don't open it up to video chat. And why? I'm listening. I'm okay. So first people, first people go, well, are you human? What do you look like, or whatever? So. I, in the, I have a picture up. At, uh, I'm part of several groups, like the insomnia group, mm-hmm. um, like groups where people stay up all night, because that's when I do it. Right. Now, men, wow. You said <laughs> choose my words wisely, so yes. I, I'm not even going to speak on it. But <laughs> Go so, ahead. Go ahead. Take your uh, time. No. No. No, no, no. Men are something else. I'll just say that. Mm-hmm. There's something else. And then, like a lady said, a man can go on the OnlyFans page mm-hmm. and get all they want to go, and they charge much more. So if that's what you want, now I'm not going to say that um, drivers over the road don't get lonely, and they might want somebody to speak a little Sassy. something naughty in their ear or whatever. Yeah. You know Sassy. what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Th- I mean, we, I mean, we all get, I mean, over the road, I mean, over the road between, you know, midnight and, and whatever in the morning, we need that, we, we need that soft, that, that soft cuddly voice in our ear talking about what y'all are going to do to us and everything. I get it. I, I get it. I know what's up, but that's what I was just simply saying that with technology, the way it is now. I mean, bros could just turn on a turn turn on Google and just be like, "Yo, give me Pornhub." You know what I'm saying? And and they and so, they're not getting charged can, for it. Now, that's true. There's so many sex sites that don't charge, but why do men still pay for sex? It's still mm. sites that charge, and they still pay for it, mm. right? Mm-hmm. I agree. So that's why I say people. Do what they want to do. Now, I have a job. And matter of fact, I have two jobs. 
So this is just what I decided to do because I'm up all night. And so it works. If the phone rings, I'm fine with it. If it don't, I'm okay with it too. So I do understand with the technology and all of that. I do understand it. I get it. And you would be surprised. There are young people, young people that has called with problems. Right. You know, so, you know, my, me and myself, sometimes before I actually put it out there, I would sit back and think like, well, would I do it? But then it's not even about me. It's like, it's about someone who needs help. Like, if I was down, I wouldn't stand on the corner with a sign that when I drive past them, I'll give them what I can. Right. See what I'm saying? So just because I wouldn't do something, that don't mean nobody else would. That don't mean nobody else don't need the help or whatever. So, Well, let me let me ask you this, uh, no. DWC. And I, I know you're busy, and I appreciate you giving me the time. So tell me, tell without going into much detail, Tell me a crazy conversation that you probably had and probably tell me a, a in, well, you know, a, a conversation that you probably had that uh, that you was able to help somebody out and say, you know, tell me a crazy conversation that the conversation kind of went left without going into too much detail. Okay. Well, I wouldn't say that they crazy because <laughs> it's crazy that I say this is crazy that in this day and age, mm -hmm. I know you're going to be like this lady when it comes to me and I got to really watch what I say. <laughs> it's, I was saying, <laughs> no, you can say whatever you I want. Was, you, you, you can say whatever you want, man. It's not censored over here. I would say a lot of, there are a lot of married people in this world mm -hmm. who are not, and the women are not happy. The, it's like, Men don't listen. They don't, they might see the signs otherwise not being happy and choose to ignore them and keep doing what they're doing. But one of the stories that a lady called and told me and was sharing with me is she said her husband keeps cheating on them. They have three kids. She said that she don't work. He's the sole provider. She said so she can't leave. She don't have any other family. Mm. Now, that's a situation that I no listen woman to, her. to get into. <laughs> I listen, and I've honestly told her I don't have the answer for you, but I am here. Just get vent. Some, I think, the best relief when you're going through something is to cry. Is to cry. Yeah, let all that out or whatever. Mm -hmm. So when I'm talking to him, I'm like, you can cry. You can tell me what you, what, you know, the things that, the worst things. Uh, what, I, there's no judgment. I don't know you. You don't know me. So she did. She cried. And she was like, yes, that feels better. She was like, now. But did I had to tell her the truth. Tomorrow, you're still going to have that pain. It's, it's a slow process, but you have to also get a job. You have to make steps. But she also said her husband won't let her. Mm. Now, I can only talk to you, but at this point, you might need to talk to a professional. I never tell anyone that I'm a psychiatrist or anything like that. A right. counselor, you just, you're just a stranger anything. that's, that's just, willing to give an ear. Yes. Yes. So, like, that's your husband. He don't allow... Um, he wouldn't allow her to get a job and everything. So, you know, I still talk to her. So, you know, sometimes, sir, I tell people, just like I told you, you can call me. The phone call will be free. I don't, tr when people have real deep problems, you can call me when you also need to talk. And I will still talk to you. I'm not this greedy person like, oh, every time you call me, it's $20 for the hour. Sometimes it when it get goes longer than an hour. So you could pay for the t that $20. And I'm saying that for the hour. But sometimes the conversation goes longer. Now, yeah. if I'm getting another call, yeah, I yeah. will have I... to cut it. But I'm not going to go, oh, the hour is up. Now it's time for you to call me back with another $20. It don't go that way. That's why you cannot just judge somebody on something that you see. I would rather for somebody like call and go, tell me how this works. 
And I would have told him. And they could have decided from there if they would like to call back. That's what's up. And and it's a good thing that it's a good thing that you give me the opportunity because you know, like I said, everybody everybody, you know, put their opinion. Of, of course I did. I I've been doing this for Yeah, I think that like let's conversate about this BS. Yeah, I was like, I, wow. Yeah, I, I've been doing this for I've been doing this for a long time. So but when I when I came across it, I'm over here like, whoa. Now I can understand if you could have came in like, you know, you know, like the chip, uh, like I said, like the tip jar, because this 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 ain't the first you you're not the first person to do something like this. I mean, this this went on back in the day, you know, the party lines, the one eight hundred, the one eight hundred party lines, the 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 two dollars per minute. And truck drivers back then was a part of that, you know, a part of that scene. You know, the 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 the, 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 the woman Caucasian that comes on in the middle of the night talking about, yo, you up? Give me a call. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And dudes yes, and yes. dudes will call, you know, and it'd be some it'd be some heavy set, heavy set woman, maybe a man. You know, behind the desk talking about, yeah, baby. I hear you, baby. Okay, baby. Yeah, so, I mean, what you doing, I mean, like I said, I'm not going to knock your hustle, but what you was doing, what you doing has been done. And what the, and what I'm saying is with the technology today, you know, we got apps like Zelle where truckers talk to truckers all night on the, on the Zelle app. You got, you got you got truckers that got tablets that that got every every t like you said every TV app every app you you still got Facebook you got Facebook groups you got Zelle you got you know you got all this technology it's like bruh why well, I'm looking like calling some stranger now and paying twenty dollars for an hour to talk you know what now, I'm saying I'm glad you said that. Now, it, that's what I was saying to you earlier. It's mm. called driving while conversing. That's how it started. But people from the insomnia group called as well. Right. They're not driving the truck. They just can't sleep. Mm. I also have flyers in different stores and different things. So the phone calls don't only come from truckers. Most of them come from people who just need to talk. Okay. Some of them don't even have a job. You know, it just comes from... It comes from a various. Um, di- it comes from different races, mm-hmm. so it's just not just truck drivers. I put it in the truck driving group, but I also put it in a food group. Mm-hmm. There's so many different groups. Is in a relationship group. It's in a lot of groups. Well, that's what's up. That's what's up. Well, the <laughs> DWC. A, I I really and truly appreciate you coming in and and clarifying. Thank you and clearing. Thank you. Uh, a lot of misconceptions and a lot of uh, you know, and and putting some facts out there on uh, what you actually do. You know, like I said, I'm I you know, hey, I'm definitely not gonna knock your hustle. I mean, you gotta you gotta get it how you get it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But you know, like I said, I was just. I, I was just throwing it out there like, well, maybe she should do it like a tip way. You know what I'm saying? So, but if it if if it works, it works. But it's but it sounds as though as you you're you're a genuine person and and you know, and the conversations that you know that you have with some of the people in the past, especially the guy that got off the truck, you was there to help him to keep his sanity. Because you know, a lot of truck drivers go through a lot of a lot of mental aspects and and they do honestly i'm being totally honest they do honestly need maybe that stranger to vent that stranger to talk to that stranger to be there for them because you know we don't know what's we 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 don't know what goes through all these guys mind you know they we drive all day. We we drive all day. We're lonely. We're in this truck by ourselves, 14, 14, 24 hours a day. Um, we get pissed off with our dispatchers, and we just don't have no outlet 
to uh you know to to vent here you are coming you know here you are coming with something you know coming with something that that could potentially be a great thing you know yes and you notice the hours it's it's from midnight to six in the morning those are the times where people who are married their spouse is asleep Mm -hmm. um their friends are asleep I, well, I don't know what time you sleep, but a lot of people are sleep at that time. There are a lot of people that's woke that I woke to. But most of the time, like that man said, every time I notice you're the only one up all night. There you go. So, and you was but let me ask you a question. Yes, ma'am. Can I ask you a question? Yes, ma'am. Now, if I charge $20 an hour and I did the, the video and I was naked and gave oh. the man, would, would, would $20 be asking too much? But you wanna be bad, you're feeling, feeling, feeling. No one wants to be the feeling. 